Now, Susan, Phil, definitely an end of an era, but this isn't a sad thing. They are letting customers know you have till tomorrow. There are signs up uh, all over the store letting people know everything from T-shirts to books, DVDs, magazines, posters. Everything is 50% off until tomorrow when they close. This has been a staple for almost 60 years here in West Hollywood. All of the products that they sold let the gay community know it was okay to be gay. It welcomed them. It embraced them. Take a look at some of the other products uh, that are around the store for nearly 60 years they sold magazines posters books dvds other uh, paraphernalia for people to come in here uh and and shop but this was more than just retail it was a sense of it gave people a place to meet a sense of community here for nearly 60 years they could come here without having the taboo placed on them for being a part of the gay community it let them know that it was okay now they're not uh sad that this store is closing this isn't a um it's an end of an era but it's more of a celebratory i, I you could kind Kind of say celebrating that you all have been here for this long and that you provided a place uh, for people. We're here with the owners. Uh, this is Karen and Barry. They're going to speak with us about uh, my first question for you, Carrie, is why do you think that, you know, after 60 years, it's been so successful, but now you have to close? Well, uh, we've been having to close for a long time. Uh, the Internet uh, really uh, caused a lot of magazines to stop publishing or people read them online. So uh, our magazine sales uh, really declined. Uh, book sales um, are almost non-existent. Every book we have here is used, um, which we were a new bookstore. People, uh, including me, can I can read on a device, and I'm in my 70s. Uh, <laughs> so um, I don't need to have a book in my hand anymore and I like reading, and DVDs, uh, I can also stream, right. uh, although I don't know how to work the remote, but I can watch movies on streaming, so a store like this just doesn't have a place uh, for what it did all these years. We had a very good run, by the way. Now, before they tell me to wrap it up, but even though, oh, we do have to wrap it up, we'll have a little more on this later tonight, but one thing I wanted to uh, to touch on was even though this place is no longer needs to be here for reading, the gay community is still welcome around here. This doesn't mean this place is still going to be in place of a new business, right? And the new business is going to be called Shishi LaRue's Circus, which will carry on some of the tradition here of uh, adult material. So they'll still have a place. I'll send it back to you in the studio. We're reporting live from West Hollywood. Leah Uko, Fox 11 News.